costume. Puppy over there, patchouli, she's in her cute little Halloween costume. Actually, that's not her official costume. Anyway, let me just finish this intro. So today I am going to be showing you a couple things that I got. You could call this a fall inspired grocery haul. I'm not going to show you all the groceries I got because some of the things are like my typical what I get every grocery trip like kale and things like that. This time I'm going to show you some special fall inspired groceries. Let's dive right in. There is a cat down there. But Julie, get your butt down. No ma'am. Okay, I officially put patchouli in her kennel. She may squeak and squawk, I'm not sure. Hopefully she behaves during this video. So, let's give it a go. Okay, so first of all, I got these bars and I'm not typically a bar person, but Adam and I have been running around like crazy lately and just been so busy that, you know, he likes bars and I feel like I, was I holding that upside down? I'm really good at this. All right, here you go. Go raw. So he likes bars and I thought it was nice because it was raw and you know, it's got pumpkin seeds in it. So it's, it's going with the fall theme, right? Next up, what would this fall be without a handy dandy pumpkin spice? Am I right? So it's cinnamon, ginger, nutmeg, and cloves. Pumpkin spice and everything nice, right? Next, I got the Simple Mills um, pumpkin muffin and bread. I guess you can make pumpkin muffins or, or bread. Almond flour mix. I'm excited. I actually also got this organic pumpkin spice applesauce to make these and to make waffles with so we can have pumpkin waffles. So I'm really excited about that. I realized after I bought this that I don't like have those muffin tins. So yes, I will be making pumpkin bread. Next, I got this pumpkin spice oatmeal because Adam likes oatmeal. I will have it occasionally. Actually, a lot of the stuff that I got was intended for Adam. I guess because they're more breakfasty stuff and I don't really do breakfast, but that's okay. I'm intrigued to try it regardless. Then I got two pumpkin purees. I might do a couple videos on, um, or a video on some drinks and things I can make with some pumpkin puree. I actually, Adam brought me a, a coffee from downstairs and it's got, it's like the pumpkin spice one that uh, he brought me, which is delicious. But I'm thinking I could create something even more pumpkin and fall inspired. So stay tuned, I might make a video. Yeah, like smoothies, coffee drinks. Would you be interested? Let me know down below. Then I got this sparkling pumpkin spiced apple cider, which I'm really excited about. We're gonna crack that baby open here soon. And then here's basically a non-sparkling version. So yeah, it's just less fancy, I don't know. Guys, I'm like so pumped about this. This is um, the brand Good Karma and it's a dairy-free pumpkin spice nog. So I mean, hello. I got dun, 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 a pumpkin, an actual pumpkin, but it's a pie pumpkin. So I can actually make a pie with this, which I'm excited about because that's what I'm gonna do with it. But it's also cute, it sits out in our home until I wanna make it into a pie. And then these guys are just cute. I like them. Okay, I'm actually gonna be real with you guys. I'm not a huge orange color person. Um, so when it comes to decorations for like Halloween and fall, I don't really go for the orange. Sometimes I'll go for black, but I, I'm pretty basic and I like the white pumpkins. I'm not gonna lie, it fits the aesthetic of our place. So don't wanna throw it off too much, but I do like a good orange pumpkin. Oh, I have something else. I have to go get it. This thing is full of granola, pumpkin seed and flax granola or something. It's pretty delicious actually. Yeah, it's pretty great. It's gonna go everywhere. But Julie, you'll be so excited. So there's that. Um, oh, we also got a bag of tortilla chips that had like pumpkin seeds in them. Here, here's the granola. Okay, anyway. We got a bag of tortilla chips with pumpkin seeds in them, like I said. We ate all of them, so the bag is not with us anymore. Yeah, we finished them, because grocery shopping is one of the most excruciating things whenever you are hungry. So guys, I think that's pretty much it. That was actually shorter than I thought it was gonna be, but short and sweet is kinda where it's at, so I guess that, that's gonna be it. Julie, I guess I'll let you out of your kennel now. Well, I'm gonna put the food away first. She's gonna, she's gonna go to town on all this. But thank you guys so much for watching. I love you so much. If you wanna see a what I made for fall, um, for drinks and things like that, smoothies, coffee, or any kind of like smoothie bowl, let me know down below. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. It really does help me a lot. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Until next time, 
Love you guys. Bye. You guys, this is what I deal with. How can you resist that face? Do you want out? She does. Oh, she's gone. Nope. Okay.